They aim to become world champions and are stars of the future. It's a 28-man squad which consists of 16 forwards and 12 backs and includes six players who featured in last year's tournament in New Zealand. Eighth man, Henry Liebenberg, captains a side that includes the Dupree twins, Dan and Jean-Luc, sons of former box scrum off Robert Dupree. It's a well-balanced side. I think there's, there's enough uh, experience in the side and there's enough physicality and there's definitely enough speed and uh, 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 skill as well. So uh, I'm, I'm very positive about the side. Some of the players to look out for are backline players Warwick Galant and E.W. Fulyun and prop forward Thomas de Toy. So which are the teams to look out for at the championships? England is very strong in this competition. Uh, New Zealand, we played them twice last year in New Zealand and uh, we, we came out triumphant against them and we missed out by one point in the final against England. So I would say, you know, all the, the, the top rugby playing countries are, are, are a threat. The junior box beat Argentina 2-0 in a test series as part of their preparation for the tournament and are brimming with confidence. I think we have a good back, I think we have a good back, so I think no, just the, the combination that we play each game, would, um, that's going to make us the winning side and I think yeah, just the team spirit, we have a good team spirit at the moment, guys are feeling good, I think we had good preparation in Argentina. The team leaves for Italy on Wednesday, their first game is against Italy on the 2nd of June, followed by group matches against Samoa and Australia. Craig Murray, SABC News, Cape Town.